Hi everybody, Allison Cope. Welcome to the Chibitronics YouTube channel. Today we're going to be making a special message reveal card featuring our white fade animating LED lights. Let's get started. We have already made up our card front and I have heat embossed our secret message. We're going to glue it literally to the back of that image right in the middle of that red balloon. And the reason why I chose to glue it flat like this is because it projects a better image through the card and the cardstock to reveal that secret message once everything is lit up. All right, let's build our circuit. We're going to put our white LED fade lights, our animating lights, right inside that large full scale balloon. So I'm going to use our craft stencil today and I'm going to trace out the location of our two animating light stickers and I'm going to put them tip to tip. So their negative points on the sticker are both at this very same spot. And there we go. There's two of those. Now we're going to locate our battery holder. We have these brand new paper battery holders which are fantastic. They are self-adhesive. I'm just going to trace around the base just to indicate the location of our battery holder today. There we go. Just fill in that bottom gap. I like to use my craft stencil because it's easy. All right, you're going to peel off the backer and you're going to place your battery holder into that gap. One, two, three, easy as pie. And now we are going to design our circuit. So I'm going to start with the negative side and I need to connect the base of the battery holder to the points of my LED stickers. I'm just going to map this out using a blue pen. We're just going to create some straight lines just because straight lines are easier to use with our conductive fabric tape. An easy two part line and we've already got one full side of our circuit. And that again is our negative circuit, our negative side. All right, let's do the positive side. Now we have to take both positive sides of our stickers, which is the fat side of those triangles. And we need to connect them to the lid or the top of our battery holder today. So we're going to draw lines out to cross both those fat aspects of our sticker. And then we're going to bring it down to the outside of our lid for our battery holder. Again, only a few straight lines and we're going to then connect it to our battery holder like so. Next, we're going to take the backing off of our conductive fabric tape. And we're going to basically go over top of those circuit lines. We're going to start with the negative. I like to start with the negative to place that tape underneath the battery. We're going to basically fold it back on itself to create a 90 degree angle and take it across to the two points of our stickers and give it a little snip. One, two, three. And then we're going to take our conductive fabric tape across the positive side of our circuit. We're going to start on the inside flap of our battery holder and going to wrap it all the way around to the front and then back down to the panel in which we're building our circuit. Again, just a flip of the tape to fold back on itself to create that 90 degree corner. Conductor fabric tape is really flexible, so you can make curves and bend it and make all kinds of contorted shapes with it. I'm going to take it all the way up to the top this time, bending around that 90 degree corner, and finally going over top of the positive side of where our sticker is going to be located and a quick press of the finger just adheres that tape right to the circuit building surface. And don't forget we have one more little piece there and nothing special. 
is needed to make this joint, you just take another piece of your conductive fabric tape and as long as it is overlapping the other side, the, the long piece there, it's all going to connect up and going to work perfectly for the positive side of your circuit. Let's add our actual stickers. These ones are animating stickers, which means they do some kind of function. In this case, it's a white light that fades in and out. And they, in this case, are heart shaped. So each sticker clearly is uh, labeled with positive and negative side of the sticker and you just match them up to the positive and negative sides of your circuit and voila, your light stickers are all ready to go. Let's finish off our battery holder. I'm just gonna peel off the backer of this C-shaped foam and I'm going to put it inside of that battery holder and this helps stabilize your battery so it doesn't disappear or float around in that circuit. And now creates a switch by giving it a press. There we go, and the lights are fading in and out. One final task is to add the three-dimensional foam tape to the inside, and this just helps um, make up for the three-dimensional aspect of our battery. I'm going to take our three-dimensional foam and go all the way around the outside of our circuit. And here she is, our cute special message. <laughs> and there it is, happy birthday. And it fades in and out. Thanks so much for joining me. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I hope to see you again soon.